whole left click, right click thing. So. At least I got meat. Because I was doing the. Oh, and they, they killed it by themselves, too. I see a bunch of X's everywhere. Because I, I, I figured I'd do a service to the. Um, to the village. But, uh. Guess not. Get up. Press twice, left shift. Oh, left shift. There you go. That's the thing I, I had a problem with. Alright, alright, I'm getting a hang of this. Except the driving part. Yeah, I'm, uh, keep running. My horse is kind of stuck, so I'm just going to park it right here. All right. Controls are still. It's been howling like since the beginning of the game, dude. Red health bar, steel, silver health bar, silver sword. Thank you. But it doesn't do it automatically, right? So I guess it's this guy? Yep. Military camp. No locals allowed without the express consent of the garrison commander. I look like a local to you. You look like trouble. Dead wrong. I make trouble go away. I'm a witcher. A witcher? Captain Peter Sugwin Levy is in the tower. Turn right, past the gate. Guessing your captain's got work for me. This is the army, Nordling. There is no guessing. To the tower. Go. Jeez. All right. He said right. Oh, that tower. That's a tower. Uh, it looks like the tower. All right. I think it does that automatically if you don't disable that option. Oh, cool. It's good to know. Because I know in Witcher 2 I had to swap. How much grain will your village give? Whatever you say, Your Excellency. Look at my hands. Look. See the calluses? These are not the hands of an Excellency, but of a farmer. So we speak peasant to peasant. How much can you give? Forty bushels. There'd be more, sir, but our lads, the Temerians, that is, took from us earlier and... You will give 30, and that will do. Let us settle on it, and I wish to see the transport soon. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you kindly. I summoned only the Elderman and the Smith, Willis. But it is said he is a dwarf. You are too tall to be him. Hehehe. <laughs> Yeah, well. Very perceptive of you. Geralt of Rivia, Witcher. Vatgarn. This explains why I did not hear your footsteps. What do you seek here? It's got a weird forehead. Where was she headed? That is a military secret. Haven't thrown me out yet. Haven't called the guards. So go ahead. What's your price? There is a griffin in the area. Slay it, and then I shall see what I can do. It's, it's 
still not very precise. I still curse a lot when I try to get out of the water. I heard it. It's it said that it plays better with a controller. I don't know. I'm a keyboard and mouse player myself. Yeah, that, that's the thing, right? Every game is better with a controller for some reason. It's because the designers they make it that way. Uh, it's like the, there's no PC developers these days. Kind of sad, and I understand why. I mean, a lot of people grow uh, grew up with like the uh, 8-bit, 16-bit era of console games, and they stick with it. And consoles are, you know, easier to make games for, and etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. But it's like, what happened to the PC gamers, folks? Like, come on, make good games. Um, why do you care about it? And and just because you can plug in a controller is not a good excuse in my mind, anyways. All right, well, it's a deal. It's a deal. Some questions before I start. Know where the Griffin has its lair? It kept to the Vulpine Woods at first. I sent a patrol there, five young men. A hunter found them two days on. They only recognized them because they wore our plate. Since then, the Griffin has grown bold. Attacks in villages, fields, on the main road. Yes. It's abandoned its lair. Gonna have to set a trap. I judge from your tone this will not be easy. What do you require? The girl I'm looking for. Um, I could use more information about the Griffin. Need more information about this Griffin. It's sex. Why it's abandoned its lair. Shall I bring you witnesses? They won't say anything I don't already know. I need to go where your men died. Look around. What's the name of the hunter who found them? Mislov. He has a hut south of the village, very near the wood. Helpful fellow. A little strange, though. See, this is how you build up a quest. You set it up. You know, some merchant is running around with his cart, gets attacked by a griffin, has no bearings whatsoever with your quest, and then you do other shit, and then it leads here where, hey, we got a problem with that griffin, and then it's, ye I love it. Alright, so I'm gonna... I'll need bait, a specific herb, buckthorn. Scent should lure the griffin from ten miles off. Buck... Buckthorn? I do not know this. But I am not yet fluent in the common tongue. Mm -hmm. Probably mastered the basics, though. Hands up. Kill them. Dude. No. First came idioms. Don't play with fire, for example. Go to Tomira, an herbalist. She lives near the crossroads. She will aid you. Which are really doesn't like him. Mira and Mislav. Thanks. I had a lot of input or reaction lag in many modern games when you play with a keyboard and mouse. Good old Quake Engine. Never did that. <laughs> no! Uh. Pretty much any PC game in that era never did that. Uh, it's just the way it is. Your current quest has more than one objective. You can choose which order to attract. All right. Well, I'll just just okay. Hi. This is in Skyrim. You don't need to we have do thumes. It's a very windy game. Or it has a, a lot of wind in it, I should say. Okay. Um, right. Whoa. Alright, so... Where is it leading me? South here? 
Is that a village? Guarded treasure. Ooh, I like that. Wait, now I don't run? Okay. That's an interesting way of introducing a fast travel. I wish these games had first person. Uh, I am. Mm, I prefer the Elder Scrolls because it's primarily they're in first person. But the combat system in this game would have to be drastically different for it to be in first person. Um, which changes a lot of things. Cinematic, stuff like that. It's hard to play first person and then pull out and see your character in third person and pull back in and see it in first person. So it's like, okay, this is beautiful stuff. But, um... I'm okay with third, so long as it presents itself well and plays well. Here it presents itself really well. Um, it remains to be seen as far as me being able to play it properly. Because right now, of course, I'm having issues. Holy jeez, man. I'm not even holding control anymore, and my guy is walking. I don't want to press shift, because whatever it's doing, I'm actually liking it right now. It lets me see... Of all the subtleties, it doesn't have a kneel down and pick up plant animation. Which I find rather odd. This got my attention, and it's just a beehive. All right, and that can't be good. Okay. Basically, games need virtual reality, but it needs to be something so modern that it doesn't feel as clunky as it does right now. Yeah, right now, VR, I'm not too keen on the, uh, ooh, nice. I'm not too keen on the whole shtick. Uh, might as well just call it a gimmick at this point. But, if there's anything that allows you to stay uh, put, like sitting down and look around, like flight simulators, racing games, that kind of thing, um... They're perfect for it. Anything else, like playing The Witcher 3 in virtual reality, I can't see that. Because what are you, like a floating ghost? Um, or would you be first person? Uh, how would you walk around? That kind of stuff. And some people have done rigs where they, they chain them up. Uh, or they attach themselves to a, like a, a, a treadmill, that kind of thing. But it's... Meh. I'm, I'd rather just sit down and play with a mouse and keyboard. What happened? Monsters! Monsters from the swamp! Folk said the road was fraught with peril, but I wouldn't listen. Got my comeuppance now. Less moaning, more details. What happened, and how can I help? And remember, I don't work for free. Witcher's Code and all. Witcher's Code? I was on my way to the Black Ones to trade. Suddenly my horse got spooked. Ran clear off the road. We hit a bump. I went flying and the horse and cart rolled on. Then I heard bubbling, neighing, slurping. Something came out from the muck. Devoured Asher, hooves and all. No doubt my goods are still on the cart. But I'm too afraid to go and see. 